to just wake up. Hey peeps, it's your girl Blessed Gaza Diva and welcome back to the Blessed Gaza Diva channel and people, Spice footer hype now at it. Spice is headlining the LGBT festival in Toronto. Footer hype is not taking it well and Bonte Killer is being involved in it. I don't know how. Anyway, as we progress, we will get into that. Let's kick it. <laughs> Spice to headline Pride Toronto 2022 LGBTQ Festival and that's from Dancehall Mag and the author Claudia Gardner. A day after Footer Hype rebuked some Jamaican female entertainers whom he said were using their platform to promote same-sex activities, Canadian LGBT group Pride Toronto has announced that Dancehall artist and diva will be the headline act for their Pride 2022 celebrations. So Dancehall Mag did not just leave the article there, Dancehall Mag posted this and that's how footer hype got involved because i'm like how did footer hype find this article he's not going around looking for these sort of article anyway dancehall mag a day after at footer hype music and they tagged footer hype in it rebuke some jamaican female entertainers whom he said were using their platform to promote same-sex activities canadian lgbt group pride toronto has announced that dancehall Diva at Spice Official will be headline act for their Pride 2022 festival celebrations in June next year. According to the LGBTQ group, the long-awaited return of the event will include all signature favorites, including the annual Trans March, Dyke March by Plus March programming, Blockorama by Blackness, Yes Pride Parade, Street Fair, and multiple stages featuring over 300 two slgbtq plus artist so footer hype took to his instagram and footer hype reposted the article and he wrote this lengthy caption in all my 20 plus years as an established product of jamaica and dancehall and reggae music this is the first time i feel completely defeated ashamed embarrassed weak betrayed in my subconscious mind i was confident that two people i would never live to see do this was at spice official and grung godzilla this now drives a serious fear in my consciousness that all hopes is lost this submission to the devil has become the new thing for dancehall artists the new norm for our culture based on what i see going on is moral devaluations they are no longer important the only thing that matters is money the preservation of our music culture and righteous values don't count honestly on the name of the almighty i was banking on hope that no matter what at spice official would never give in to something like this i guess i was dead wrong this is a big l for the ancestors of jamaica and the music given to us by the almighty money has officially poisoned and crippled our industry well maybe this is a band show if not it would be said that at spice official wouldn't consider the well-being and career of her dj after this shema kill me god no so we took to the comment section people and of course we're going to read some of the comments everybody i bow down to them now shakes my head new world order in play make your money spice all money is not good money shakes my head she's on love and hip-hop what did you expect i endorse this message or music has hit a new low the lowest i've ever seen as a jamaican i'm embarrassed and ashamed by this the music gone to the dogs now maji she being there performing doesn't mean she supports it nonetheless she is just working the same as how she work on any other show making her honest bread the difference is the nature of the event i perceive it that way someone else at this point footer nothing in the world shocks me anymore remember as they love to say nowadays to each his own so they use that saying to say f what anybody thinks jamaicans have lost everything named values and morality they don't even know the meaning anymore as long as you stay solid and keep to your belief that's all we can do nowadays the love for money is the root of all evil s my effing head why are you surprised it's been rumored for years now that she likes to rob just saw this and my spirit is down ever since not 
Tomato Spice. Please tell me this is a prank. Jano, wow, them gone with her. You are going to live to see enough more. When people go to Rome, they do as a Roman do. But Futa, why are you surprised? And she been having by dancers. Don't see any difference because she never did a bond them out before. So why wouldn't you think she will now? P.S. It's a question. Uno, don't flames me out. Please, and think in advance. People, now, based on what I have just read, I can see that he really has no qualms with Bunty Killer. He's just calling out to say that Bunty Killer and Spice are two hard artists that he never dream or dare see do this. Now, you know how Bunty Killer is active and vivid and open about these sort of things from top to bottom. So, why for butter? But you understand what I am saying. So, Bunty Killer has always been against this. So, Futaipe is saying that he never dreamt that he would live to see Spice or he would live to see Bunty Killer do that sort of thing. So, it's not like Bunty Killer is a part of this festival, participating in this festival or have anything to do with this festival as far as I can see and read in the two articles, the one on Dancehall Mac and the one on Bunty Killer's page. No to Spice. No, Spice people are saying that she lives in america so what do they expect spice has always been an individual who going do our thing one way or the other one of spice's biggest fan is a part of the lgbt community so for futa not to know this because futa was just in a recent life where futa hype said he noticed spice have some people where she posts on her page so him stop follow her right and spice chem chem or shem shem or i think it's chem chem or shem chem that is spice biggest fan and everybody know that shem chem is in england and a part of that community so i i guess that's that's a person probably that foot type saw her posted so for foot type to be saying that he's shocked i think he's more shocked at her performing at an event versus being a part of these people because even in atlanta where she is she deals with these people on love and hip-hop she clearly has to deal with these people in america and anybody who lives in america has dealt with these people not saying that oh you're friends with these people but they're everywhere and you see them every day now performing at the show i can understand why it's giving him a big blow because he must be thinking in him head all right she have our fans them so our fans them can be anything and me can understand that so me i just click and follow up on our page however i don't and never ever dream to see her taking money for a performance of a show like this i think that is what has him concerned or feeling some kind of way anyway people my opinion on this is simple spice is gonna do what she wants to do Futa is gonna do what he wants to do Futa needs to know, preserve himself and make sure that he stays true to what he believes in. Because as him see around him, people are going to do what they believe in. Anyway, people, tell me your thoughts on down below in the comment section. And as per usual, we'll have a discussion. If you've not yet subscribed to my channel, please hit the notification bell. And if you've not yet smashed the like button on this video, smash the like button and send this out. I'm out. Best is a big day for us. It's a big day for us. My ear won't come and everything, but we could not stop for brush out that area. Me have to talk about this. Yes, it's today, Friday. Mm -hmm. You can click the link in my bio and pre order my album. Best you will find out you have an album. They couldn't stop it. They couldn't wipe it down. The album, you can pre order it. Pre order my album. Click the link in my bio. Make sure you support me, guys, the real way. And here we're going now. Once you pre order my album, Get an next phone if you don't have two phone, make a friend video yo. Show me say you pre-order my album. Yeah. Just say anything you want to say. Say whatever your name is. This is my just pre-order Spice album. 10 coming out August 6th for our birthday. And do whatever you want to do. And just post them, tag it in my story. And I will post it on my feed. Because me like to support real people who support me. More the whole world to see who support me. Make your video right now.